to JMTV GH. Uh, today I'm here once again to bring you another great episode. Um, as last episode, we ended in the middle, so today we will continue and finish what is spiritual cleansing and how can we go about it with Togbe Toto Sao. So today I'm here with Toto Sao, Togbe Toto Sao. So some of you who can't mention the name, the Toto is T H O T H O. S eh? S A O. Eh? The other day, somebody mentioned the name. I love that. So I'm here with Toto Sao. So we are going to continue the spiritual cleansing. How you go about it? Can you do it in your own, or <laughs> unless you find a spiritual man to do a spiritual cleansing for you, eh? you have to know the right thing before you go to do something else. So um, don't forget to subscribe share comment and like i'll not waste much time this one no break issue let me go to talk with tuto sao and continue the spiritual cleansing because the other day talk with tuto sao say something they say uh, I, I think i forgot the issue uh, but when i get there I, i'm sure i'll remember then i'll ask tuto sao because the other day he said something uh, i have to ask him if he can remember and correct me. Uh, Toby, I go. Uh, Magado and Dina, okay? Yo, where is it? My phone is My phone. I'm going to call you. Today, Toby, I've come to you to continue the spiritual cleansing from where we ended. Uh, I think you were saying something the other day that we must do before uh, the spiritual cleansing. You said the process how to go to spiritual cleansing process or pray. Yeah, I think I remember the question. You say, for using one prayer for everybody is not good. Can you give us more explanation? Because uh, one, let me start from church house. When you go to church, maybe they'll say, oh, uh, if you, you are not having baby, come here, then we all go. Then they pray for us that God should give us baby. Oh, if you are not having job, come forward. That's how we do it. Sometimes, to uh, some of us, when we go to the Vuju people and the other side, they just bring all of us, maybe five, eight, ten people. Then they will do the cleansing for us. You see, those things, it's not good that way. So, how it is? Well, uh, welcome. Thank you. Uh, yes, the question that you ask. In the African spiritual perspective, mm -hmm. we don't do spiritual cleansing or, or soul processing using by using one formula for everybody. We don't do it. Wow. If you do it, it will not work for them. I'm repeating it. We don't use one formula mm -hmm. to do spiritual cleansing for everybody. We don't do it. Mm -hmm. If you do it, it will not work. It will not help them. Okay. The reason is that mm -hmm. everybody in this life mm -hmm. is on a certain vibration. Okay. It's on a certain law and order. Okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. So even if you give birth to twins, they are different. Yes. Now, let's assume two people mm -hmm. As this year, 2020, mm -hmm. started, mm -hmm. we are in it. Mm -hmm. What the first person is doing, mm -hmm. person A, what is doing, is different from what person B will be doing. Oh. What Kojo will be doing is different from what Kwesi will be doing. Mm -hmm. So, all the things that Kofi will be saying from... 1st January 2022 mm -hmm. up to 31st December 2022 mm -hmm. all the things Kofi will be doing they are all different okay the things Kofi will see is different Kobana will not see yeah you understand mm -hmm. the things that I will listen to you will not listen to them yes the things that I will say you will not say them yes so why is it that if it comes to processing mm -hmm. doing cleansing for them why do you group the two using the same thing? It will not work. Okay, so let me ask this question. What about when I come to a diviner and maybe he wanted to do the cleansing for us, 
but he do divination for each person and see the code that you're talking about. But at the same time, going to the processing, they, they, they do it for all of us at the same time. What about that one too? You see, mm -hmm. no diviner will divine for you mm -hmm. and get a code for you. Mm -hmm. For Kweku and get code for Kwabena. Mm -hmm. Then bring Kweku and Kwabena together and purify them. Nobody will do that. Mm -hmm. The code you have is different from the code the other person is having. Yes. So the formula within the code of somebody who is born on Saturday mm -hmm. or Kofi, let me just use the, the code that I get for Kofi, I will use that formula. The formulas fall within Kofi's code. Yeah. We only go for Kofi. Okay. The formulas that will go to Kwame. Kweku mm -hmm. or Kwame will go to him. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. But there is no way you bring the two together and use one formula for them. It is not possible. So if those things is going on, is that mean because of losing the original African spirituality, that's why it, it goes if, in that if, way? If people do that, mm -hmm. then it is not right. Because me sitting here, my vibration is different from your vibration. Mm -hmm. So if I need spiritual cleansing, mm -hmm. there is no way they will do the spiritual cleansing for the two of us at a go. Mm -hmm. It is not done anywhere. Okay. The law and mechanism, the law and order governing you must be dealt with. Mm -hmm. And my two must be dealt with separately. Mm -hmm. So we don't group two or more people okay. and giving them the same prayer point. Mm -hmm. It will not work. I see. It will not work. So if you come that you want spiritual cleansing, mm. I will check you and know what went wrong okay. and what went right. Okay. I have to know. Mm -hmm. And once I know, mm. then I know the formula to use for your processing, mm -hmm. for your spiritual process, uh, processing or cleansing. Mm. You understand? Mm -hmm. So another person also come, you look at the person, mm. You divine for the person. Yeah. The code that comes will tell you everything about the person. How the person started first January 2021 mm -hmm. and ended up 31st night 2021. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. So you look at the, 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 the fan code that will come will give you definitions, how you live your life, mm -hmm. what you did right, what you didn't do well, all of those things will pop up. Mm -hmm. Then you know how to handle the person spiritually. Okay. But if you just, you know, do everything the same thing for all of them it will know you are destroying them rather Ooh. yes because what you're doing for kwesi that formula must not work for kwesi and you are using that formula for kwesi you are adding death to death mm -hmm. you're adding another death okay so because of christians are watching this uh, program let, let me ask this question for them because i'm getting some this thing so can we say if the same thing happened in the church, some people will not get that they are result in prayers. I am telling you that it will not work. You can't use the same prayer point, the same formula for everybody. It is not possible. They are all different entities. Mm. They are all different. So what would you want to use the same formula point for all of them? And because of uh, we, we, you are destroying we are them. Need, need the same prayer. It's like you, the person who is doing spiritual processing, mm -hmm. cleansing for them. You don't know what you are doing. Mm -hmm. If you understand human nature, if you understand that everything in this life has its own sound vibration, okay. has its own formula, then you know that you must handle them individually according to their vibration okay thank you thank you to us so per the explanation you give it to us go with the question i wanted to ask so how does spiritual cleansing goes you see i've answered that in some way mm. spiritual cleansing once you come to me that you want to do spiritual cleansing mm -hmm. i will consult a fan mm -hmm. you understand yeah as I consult a fan, mm -hmm. the code that will come, mm -hmm. that code, I will go into the code, mm -hmm. explain, tell
tell you the stories within that code, give you everything mm -hmm. within the code. Okay. Then I will tell you how you did A, how you did B. Mm -hmm. All the things that you did, I will start pointing them to you. Okay. I will tell you how you live your life. Mm -hmm. What you did right, what you didn't do well. Mm -hmm. A fan will tell you. Mm -hmm. A fan will not hide it from you mm -hmm. because a fan want to direct you mm. on your path. Okay. So once that code appears, you are going to go within it, De redefine the person. Okay. What you did from February 2021 to first 31st night 2021. Mm. So we'll give you all of these things, then give you the guidelines, the procedures that you'll be going through. Okay. I will give you all of these procedures. Mm. So you will be aware. Okay. And yourself, the things that you went through, you know. Okay. So once a fan is telling you that this and this and that you did, a fan will not deceive you, mm. will not lie to you. So once you go through, then we will give you the process that you go through. So the process Kweku will go through is different from the process Kwame will go through. Mm. It's different. Okay. Okay. Uh, so my next question is, uh, can I do spiritual cleansing on my own? You see, or on my own? spiritual cleansing starts from you. You must start spiritual cleansing mm -hmm. or soul processing by yourself mm. first. Eventually. For you getting that state of awareness mm. that I want to do spiritual cleansing, mm -hmm. I want to look for a spiritual leader to guide me through spiritual cleansing. Mm -hmm. That step alone, you have started the process. Okay. But once you come to me mm -hmm. and I have given you what and what I have to do for you. Mm -hmm. After taking you through, it doesn't mean that if you go home, that's all. Mm. No. Mm -hmm. The divination that I did for you, the sound code that I had, mm. I will give you some formulas from it. Okay. So once you go home, mm -hmm. especially the day you are born, if you are born on Tuesday, yeah. you start practicing from Tuesday. From Tuesday. Okay. You use all the days, but on that particular day that you are born you use you spend more time on that day on that day okay doing your spiritual cleansing mm. you'll be indoor alone you know give i will give you some formulas that you apply mm. give you some spiritual helps if you are not in ghana mm -hmm. then it means that you use the sound formulas mm -hmm. to do cleansing you understand mm -hmm. through meditation you do cleansing but if you are in ghana you get the helps to then you go through the proper spiritual cleansing so spiritual cleansing doesn't mean that you go to your pastor or you go to your spiritual father father mm -hmm. for him to do spiritual cleansing for you and that's and that end it there no you have work to do yourself so so that i'm coming okay so that formula that mm -hmm. i i will give you mm -hmm. that i'm going to give you mm -hmm. You start using it. Okay. It means that I have given you step. Okay. How to start doing cleansing on your own. Oh, okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. So it means that that year throughout, any time least chance you have, you do cleansing on your own. Okay. Any chance you have, if it is office, that you have five minute chance, you can quickly go within yourself. See. and apply these formulas mm -hmm. and start doing cleansing within yourself okay it doesn't mean that you once i take you through that cleansing then you have to wait and come another year mm -hmm. no i said earlier on that it must be habitual okay it is something that you must always do because every day you are eating mm -hmm. you are drinking mm -hmm. you are seeing you are mm -hmm. touching you are listening to so many things and you are saying a lot of things wow. so you have to be doing these things you know on your own mm. yes it doesn't mean that you have to pile them down if you are doing that you get sick mm. if you are piling it you get sick oh, yes. so anything that comes in you have to try to take it off all right thank you toby so is there any change in one's life after cleansing oh yes compulsory why are you why are you doing cleansing it means that you want good for yourself mm. So all the dead, all the things that you have gone through, mm -hmm. you take them off. Only the good, good ones will be preserved or maintained in the system. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. So it helps. Spiritual cleansing helps. It must your physical being, mm -hmm. your body, mm -hmm. 
as we call it in the fire of bully. Yeah. You know, this your body is actually when you are sick, it affects the body. Yeah. So the body is the main thing that sickness affects. Okay. Sickness doesn't affect your soul. Okay. So once your body is being affected, mm -hmm. has been affected, what it means is that it's going to block the development of the soul. Okay. It will not permit the soul to, to do, anything. to grow or okay. search for whatever it needs. Mm -hmm. So once you go to the spiritual cleansing, it is going to help you mm -hmm. to achieve what you want to achieve in that year. Okay. So spiritual processing helps a lot. It helps a lot because it is one thing that is going to free you from whatever you know, you doing. thing that you are using to block your own chance. Mm. It will take them off from the system. So spiritual cleansing, it, 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 it does help. Okay, okay. So let me ask this question. Does one's ancestor also involve in spiritual cleansing? Why not? Are you not coming from a spiritual lineage? Oh. Yes. Every soul, even the animals, they come from spiritual lineage. Wow. So we human beings, we also come from, we came from spiritual lineage. Mm -hmm. So whatever you do, that is what ancestral connection, I don't joke with ancestral connection. Oh, okay. Ancestral connection, almost the people who call me or come to me, ancestral connection is very important. Mm -hmm. You need that support, that foundation, that spiritual foundation, you need it. It's very important. If that is weak, Whatever you do, you know. Then, then give us that ancestral connection explanation. We spoke about it several. Yeah. Ancestral connection is for you to make one with your ancient fathers. Mm -hmm. The people who establish your family, mm -hmm. who give birth to your fathers, 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 mm -hmm. before you to you are here today. Mm -hmm. You have to respect that lineage. Okay. So we normally call those people, like what we did the last time, we pour libation. Mm -hmm. It is ancestral calling. Okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. But there are other steps that we do that we initiate the people to have spiritual vibrations, spiritual okay. links to their ancestral home. Okay. You understand? Okay. So we do, we do have uh, some of these things that we give out to people for you know, connecting to their ancestors. Mm. You, you see, uh, in Africa, there is this thing that we normally don't take serious. Okay. Where will you come from? Mm -hmm. Who and who gave birth to you? We don't. We are not serious about it today. Those days, they were very conscious of, of it. Problem. But today, mm -hmm. we don't care. Like the Bible can tell you that you leave your parents, your father and mother, and marry. Mm -hmm. Doesn't mean that uh, you should disown them. Yeah. It's just telling you that when you, you grow up to a certain stage have to that you are yourself. mature, you have to settle down yourself. Okay. But the respect you must give to your lineage. Mm. You understand? Okay. So where you are coming from is very much important that you connect yourself. There are a lot of people today, they don't know anything about their family lineage. Yes, Toby, because the reason B is uh, the people change their name because if you change my name then the, the devil in my family worry me will not worry me anymore that's the reason why they don't know anything about the, uh, how about that one how are we going to deal with how that, possible can issues? you change your name many people did that your name that was coded in your spiritual lineage how can you change it if you change it you are lost mm. but if you are changing it for documentation purposes, mm -hmm. you know, to get access in one or two things, mm -hmm. it's different. But your real name, your ancestral name, you must maintain it. Mm -hmm. You must always call that name whenever you need them. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. You must not say, oh, no, no, no. Me, my, I have changed my document. So if I am, uh, uh, if I'm called by this name, I'm not going to be called that name entirely again. Mm -hmm. you're, you're lost. You need ancestral connection. Okay. If you, mm -hmm. somebody gave birth to you, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do we have somebody in this life who came 
by him or herself. No. no. So for you to 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 have parents, it means that you have some connection, some links. Mm. So it is very important that we respect our traditional lineage. It is very important. Once that there is a break in that connection, mm -hmm. you are lost. So it is very important that we respect our ancestral connection. So if you are doing spiritual cleansing mm. without ancestral connection, mm. it will not work. Okay, so if one want to come and do spiritual cleansing, as an example, and he doesn't if, know, coming, uh -huh. if you are in church mm -hmm. and the leader is praying for you mm -hmm. and you think everything is about Jesus Christ mm. and where you are coming from. You, you think it's devil, mm. you think it's primitive, it's barbaric, it's yes. satanic, you are lost. The Christianity will not work. Whatever religion it is, it will not work mm. unless you connect back to your ancestral mm -hmm. lineage. Serious, serious issue. You can mention Jesus Christ's name thousand times, it will not work. Uh, someone asked because the, Christ himself in the Bible, didn't he say, he, he he has father he, yeah and he said he, he he went to his father yeah so why are you disowning your own parents mm. why are you disowning your own family lineage because, so nobody should because deceive jesus you. said that disown them and come to me well i don't know about that but <laughs> what i want to say is that there is a need for you to connect to your ancestors mm. when christ died didn't he go to his father that's what and he said he's going to sit in the right hand side of the father, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So why are you disowning your own ancestors? I want to go to heaven. Because so my house you, they, they you are for, you know for sure you are not Christ. So if you die, you are also going to sit in the right side of your ancestors. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. That is what Christ is telling you. Mm -hmm. It's not telling you that I'm going to his father, so God you, so. you should get lost. Where is your father? Okay. Where is your grandfather? Mm. Where are your ancestors? You also go there and sit with them. Mm. So it is very important that we take African spirituality serious. Mm. African, our ancestral connection, very, very, very serious. All right, that's Togbi Totosao. You are watching JMTVGH, a program called African Spirituality. We want to take African spirituality to the world and know who we are. And come back to take our rightful thing. So um, today's topic we discussed is last time is what is uh, how do you call it? A spiritual cleansing. Yes, spiritual cleansing. And how can we go about spiritual cleansing? So the next episode, Toto South is giving us more explanation. He said, when you disown your parent, Jesus Christ said, I'm going to sit in the right side of my father. And where is your father? What he says is going to sit in the right of his father, the ancestor thing, not any god or not any mau or not any blah blah blah. You are saying all the time. So uh, I'm sure how I'm learning so much more. Yeah, we are all learning so much more. So me too, I'm learning so much more. I want to go to Togu to Tosawo to ask him final question. Then he can give us more explanation. And someone asks a question. I'll ask that question for now before I will leave today because that question I, I'm always asking myself is there anything like that so after asking my final question I've asked to how if he knows something like that then he can teach me and you or you and me so Toby yeah, go. I want to ask this uh, final question in this spiritual cleansing journey uh, what does being unclean prevent in one uh, spiritual life well uh, first and for why are you doing the spiritual spiritual cleansing we are doing spiritual cleansing for things to get better in our life mm -hmm. for our material prosperity and our spiritual growth mm -hmm. these are the reasons why we are doing spiritual cleansing okay so if you're doing cleansing because you want your business and your you want to be successful in business mm -hmm. you also want to grow spiritually mm -hmm. then it means that if you don't do spiritual cleansing uh, your business opportunities your spiritual growth opportunities they will all be in the dark okay. you understand mm -hmm. so if you don't as we are discussing today mm -hmm. 
for all you know there are people who are there who have never done spiritual cleansing in their yes, entire life before. That one is true. They don't know that there is something like Possibly. African spiritual cleansing. Yeah. So they don't know. And they'll be hearing it the first time. Mm. So we are kindly saying that it is very necessary mm -hmm. that you do spiritual cleansing. Okay. And this spiritual cleansing is about connecting yourself okay. with your eternal energy. Okay. Spiritual cleansing is about knowing yourself what you need to do right for your business and your spiritual growth to get better in terms of progress. Okay. So, if you are going through life with so many challenges, mm. yes, it is necessary you vis-a-vis -vis, you understand the situation and move life okay so by moving life you can't just you know be moving through life just like that without understanding the law and order of things around you okay so everything that you see around they all came into this existence as you also came mm. so you up to redefine yourself re go through cleansing all the time mm. so spiritual cleansing is very necessary mm -hmm. Everybody should make sure you go through spiritual cleansing. Okay. Everybody should make sure you do ancestral connection. Okay. You connect with your ancestors. Okay. So that you have a base, spiritual base, that you can stand on and construct your progress. Okay. You understand? Okay. If you don't have a spiritual support, mm -hmm. you don't have your ancestral support, mm -hmm. what are you going to stand on and create or construct your progress? Okay. See, you cannot stand on any foreign religion mm -hmm. and say you want to reconstruct your progress. It will not work. Okay. It will not work. Mm -hmm. What was used in your genetic? Okay. That is the only thing that can understand what you want to do in life. Mm -hmm. So using the sound formulas that use that was used to give birth to you, okay. it is only this sound that you can use to progress in everything you want to do. Yeah. So let us come back to our senses. Mm -hmm. Let us all visit our home. Mm -hmm. Let us all connect to our ancestors. Mm -hmm. It is very important. Yeah. Today we are having life. Mm -hmm. If we die, you all of us will one day go and visit our ancient fathers. Mm -hmm. If you go, they will not reject you. Mm -hmm. Even today, you rejected them. But if you go, they will still receive you. Mm -hmm. They will not throw you away. Okay. Yes. So why don't we accept them? Mm -hmm. Accept the fact that, yes, my father gave birth to me. My mother gave birth to me. Mm -hmm. So that we respect these connections, this link mm -hmm. spiritually. Okay. So that things can get better in our life. Mm. If we are back to our senses, everything will be possible. Okay. Let's come back home. Mm. Let's connect back to Africa. Let's connect back to our root. It is only these things connecting back to our root that can help us maintain our stability, maintain the progress of Africa, maintain the progress of the whole world. Mm. You look at the direction the world is going, it is not good at all. Okay. Man must live with man today. Woman must live with woman today. It is out of the way. Uh, I, 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 I'm sure are, we will go to that topic one day and this discuss this. Are this these things are destroying the world. Mm. So if you have ancestral connections, you will not do such things. Mm. You will not do such thing. But before we go, someone asked this question. Is there any name under this earth when you mention that name in the shrine and everything will destroy or scatter from there or the, the, the Vujuman will shake? If I get a question right, yeah. is there any name or... Yeah, that's how it like how in the or name of that, Jesus. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. That's if you go to the traditional system, yes. if you and say you mention it will, that it will name, destroy, it will destroy everything there. Uh, is there anything like that? There is nothing like that. <laughs> I am telling you. <laughs> 
there is nothing like not that. at all not at all not under this not in this universe not mm -hmm. under the sun there is nothing like this view so all we are see radio TV. see you see this life mm -hmm. no there is no god sitting anywhere mm -hmm. that is guiding you and me mm. that is guiding any, 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 uh, everybody there is no god anywhere mm -hmm. guiding us i see i'm saying this again mm. see watch inside what i am saying is that even if you go to the animals kingdom mm -hmm. you see the lions the tigers you see them killing the other animals mm -hmm. Does it mean there is no God? No. Why is God, if there is God guiding all of us, mm -hmm. why is God allowing the rabbit to be killing them, killed so. by the lion? Okay. Why are you eating goat meat? Mm -hmm. Why are you killing the goat? Mm -hmm. Why are you killing the animals to consume them, to eat mm -hmm. them? Mm -hmm. Does it mean there is no God to protect the life of that animal? Okay. You see, what I want to say is that In this universe, there are sound formulas mm -hmm. that originate with this life okay. that you can use to protect yourself. Okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. And these are what our ancient fathers have been using mm -hmm. since the beginning of time. Okay. So this sound code, these sound formulas, if you use them, if you command, if you say what you want to happen, that thing will happen. Mm -hmm. But not you say in the name of Jesus, then the traditional system will scatter, will destroy. There is nothing like that. All right, there is nothing like that. That topic. I'll, there is I'll, no I'll name in the foreign. Free. There mm -hmm. is no name in the foreign religion mm -hmm. that you are going to use or command to the traditional system for. Our system to be destroyed. There is nothing like that. No word. No body. There's nothing. He said it again. There is no nothing. There is word. Nothing. No body. There, there is, is nothing like that. That's Tobi Toto Sao. Uh, so, uh, my brother, I think I have asked your question for you, but that thing or that particular um, question you will do a topic or program for it. Let, let me come in. You see, mm -hmm. sometimes we've been seeing some movies yes. that you see they will be in the church yes. the pastor will pray then the fire will go and yes. it is we think that is how it will happen so it, it is the mind so we use imagination to it is the it. mind mm. it never happened yeah and it will never happen and and i always told people some of them are planting to destroy african spirituality so if you don't know today, I'm telling you, some there is, of them there is, are there is planted nothing, there is to nothing destroy that can our destroy, system. So nothing can destroy uh, our spirituality. They, they, they want to promote that their own is good and your own is devil. That's the reason why they normally bring some of those. No, they should things. promote this and leave ours alone. Yes. So that's the word we want to give to them these days. Promote your own, leave us our own. That's always I'm telling the Christian. If you see a God worshipping, worshipping that God, let me worship my ancestors. When we die and you go to heaven and I couldn't go, it's no problem. Eh? So don't, don't come and say, oh, by, by force, come and do my own. No, I will not force you, so don't force me, right? Yeah. To help all of us. There is no heaven anywhere. Mm. You see this life. Mm -hmm. You see this land, mm -hmm. you cannot jump it and go to Jupiter or Mars. Mm -hmm. You cannot do that. Yeah. So, once you have life here, mm -hmm. what it means is that you must perfect everything yeah. on this planet. Okay. Before if you die, you will not be able to come back to this, to this planet. But once you have not perfect, you have not factum, you have not understand, get the rules and regulation, you have not established, connect with it, this place, if you die, you come. If it is thousand times, million you times, come you will come back times. here. Mm -hmm. So we will come to that topic. Uh, you mentioned something, Jupiter. So someone told me you should discuss the four elements. 
who people are telling people every day this element is Jupiter, this one. So I that one it will be another full program. Uh, I just tell you this year is time. quality, not quantity. Because of time, today's program to we will end it here. And to Tosao, he told plain, not plain fact. There is no name. Oh. There is no name. You don't dare to go to shrine. Even if the person doesn't have nothing, you don't dare to go there and say something. So thank you very much for watching JMTVGH. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, and like as well. Today, my DOP is Mauto, my editor, Asalim JH, and my producer, Nana Ajwa. This is JM. I'll see you in the next program. Bye-bye. That when somebody brings some paper with some drawings on it and calls it money, that is all. Then they believe. One who is young, Kupo Bia Sumuno. Now, Miss Sumina Nanuma Mamre and Mehuno. Miss Sumuno says, I don't do near you, for now to me call heaven, Naman Kubia, and your problem. But the only person who said it's a time for Africa, say, Yeni Baby, Yeni Bedaho, they are who say church is a business maker with no fear. So, Sumu Yasina, your friend of Pepe and I will mock you. Ne planet no no a nipa and the intimate home.